Hey, what's up guys? Gian here of GadgetPhilippines.net. We're going to unbox a new device from Cherry Mobile and this time we're going to unbox the Cherry Mobile Smart Tab. The Smart Tab is, uh, it runs on Windows 8.1 and also runs on Android 4.4 KitKat. We cannot wait to unbox this, so without further ado, let's proceed with our unboxing. Alright, so let's now proceed with our unboxing of the Maya Smart App. Right, so this is the retail box of the device. Um, at the back, you will see the different features of the Smart App. What is amazing about this device is that it allows you to smart boot or switch operating systems. It has a Windows 8.1 and also an Android 4.4 KitKat. It's really cool. I'll proceed and look at what is what's inside the box. Okay. This is the uh, tablet, but we will proceed with the tablet later on. We have here the micro USB cable. We have the charger. Also, the user manual. And that's it. That's everything inside the retail box. Let's put it here for now. And let's take a look at the tablet. Okay. Cool. Alright, so here's the tablet. We have uh, the 8 inch screen here, the uh, uh, 2 megapixel front facing camera, there's a microphone over there, Windows logo over here, we have a micro SD slot on the left side of the device, we have the sleep and wake button and volume buffers right over the right side. There's nothing to see under the device, but up top you will find the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and also the micro USB port. At the back, we have the 5 megapixel front uh, rear facing camera, by the way. And also, minor branding, Intel branding, and Cherry Mobile branding over this side. We have, or I forget, we have the speaker right over here. Very good grasp, gra by the way. You can easily grab the device. It's not slippery in a way because of the edges. The uh, bezels are quite wide, to be honest. That's okay. Right, so, that's pretty much it. Let's try to remove uh, the plastic so you can see uh, the screen clearly. Try to open it up for the first time. Now, they told us that this is running on Windows 8.1. Still booting. But you know what? It's actually good that uh, we have a, kind, a device like this. It is compact. It is affordable. It only costs about four thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. It's pretty, pretty cheap or affordable for a Windows 8.1 tablet. To be honest. Very responsive screen. Personalize, get online, sign in. Alright, uh, PC name, GM. Next. Okay, we're now uh, signing in, but I guess uh, it is required for us to provide uh, a code which was actually sent to us for security purposes and it just restarted I guess that's one of, that's one of the steps necessary to be done by Windows to fully set up uh, the device and there's an update percent All 
Alright, so I guess it's done. It's now finally booting up after several setup. Setup. Alright, so we're here. Hi. We're setting things up for you. Alright, so it's done. Let's open it up again. 1030. Upgrade to Windows 10 for free. Okay. It just prompted me that I can already upgrade this to Windows 10, but um, should we do it? I don't know. Uh, not right now, I guess. We're gonna clear that first with our friends from Cherry Mobile and Intel. But here is it, guys. This is the device. It looks really good. It's uh, very responsive. And um, I like the fact that the screen is gorgeous. And there's a little gap that I can see here. It's not IPS, it's not uh, OGS, but you know, that's okay. Again, this is only 4999 You're getting a very good value over here. Desktop. Very cool. Um, hmm. Here. Desktop. And as you can see, there is a button here called Switch or Dual OS Switch. Which, if we click, double click, going to switch to Android OS, it says here. Click OK, it will shut down the device and turn on the Android uh, operating system. The Android, by the way, is 4.4.4. Uh, okay, that one is not a microphone, but rather that one is a notification light. Booting up again, Maya Smart Tab. And that is the, okay, the boot uh, animation. And what happened? Yeah. It's not running on Android, which is really cool. Amazing, right? Let's see. Settings about tablet. It's running on Android. Amazing. Now, how do you switch back to Windows? Not this key because if you press this, it just simply goes to the home button or to the home screen rather. But if you want to switch to Windows, all you have to do is to drop down, use the two, your two fingers to drop down the box or to drop this down and click OS switch. And that's it. Now, word of caution, do not try to um, flash this device because if you flash it with a different firmware, you will lose that OS switch. So if you mess up the system, if you mess it up, then you will lose that functionality. So now we're running on Windows. Um, as you can see, we have our desktop right here. It's kind of the same with our wallpaper on our desktop um, because it's already tied up with our uh, our profile. So, all right. So if you want to boot to Android, all you have to do is double click this, and it will tell you it will go to, to switch to Android OS. If you click OS, it will reboot the device. And in a matter of uh, probably about 20 seconds or so, you will be able to access the uh, Android operating system of the Maya Smart App, which is really an, a very neat feature, I must say. Okay. Again, if you want to switch from Android to Windows, drop down, uh, go to the drop down menu so that you'll access the switch to Windows option. There. Booting is quite fast to be honest. 20 seconds and we're good. There. there. And as you can see there is the OS switch right there. Okay, sorry. There we go. If we click that, it'll switch to Windows 8.1. Oh yeah, really cool. 
So there you have it guys, this has been our unboxing of the Cherry Mobile Maya Smart Tab. If you enjoyed watching this video, we would appreciate if you guys can give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube page, just go to youtube.com slash gadgetfilipinas and click that subscribe button. Now, we'll be reviewing this uh, Maya Smart Tab pretty soon, so uh, stay tuned for our review on our website that is www.gadgetfilipinas.net. Again, this is Gian of Gadget Filipinas and thank you and have a great day ahead.